because we didn't have that we didn't have this platform so i appreciate the platform it's just that now you've got now you've got people that not only are doing the same thing and they can do it better but you've got people who don't do anything and are just critiquing it so i sat back and i'm like okay that's fine people can talk crazy about me that's fine they should they should uh express themselves and they have a right to. But I also get to say whatever the fuck I want about you now. You've been through a very dark time in your life. You took a five year hiatus. How did you pull yourself out of that dark time? Uh, well, it was definitely, it was a process, man. It was, it was um, it took me a, 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 a while to actually admit, you know, that I had a problem. I mean, you know, in the hip hop world that I live in, I think that it can be mistaken for weakness. And the last thing you want to do in hip hop is admit that you're weak. But if I didn't admit that I was weak with this certain thing, I was going to die. After he sold his soul to Satan. Marshall Mathers. Some of you may know him as Eminem, but he's going to join the Saturday night crew with our music intro starting next Saturday night. But folks, I want to take you to the world premiere of one of his new videos called Berserk. And there is something, I'm not going to lie, there is something inside me that is a little more happy when I'm angry. just was authentic it was real it was believable for us to do a record like that and it's also something that needed to be done and the way he did it was so clever uh you know he pretty much just broke down the cycle it's, I, eminem is is an artist of class and i knew if he sent me a record there there must be something to it it, it, it couldn't just be oh duh she was in that relationship so we have to get her. It, it was really a deep song and the lyrics were so deep, so beautiful and intense. And it's something that I understood, something that I connected with, which made me think it was a hit. And I want to be a part of a hit. So, of course, I couldn't say no. My living room, and if they decided to win, go my living room. And if they do, then you can say goodnight and bye bye to them my tunes. If I don't try to record as much before I do, the plan is to have as many in the can as I can. It's like as much as I, as bad as it feels yeah. to be there, there's also something about it. There's a rush of it that I like because it inspires me to say something back. So you get in that weird area too where it's like, oh, he says he doesn't care about what anybody thinks about him but now he cares about what everybody thinks about him. No, he's just saying he don't care. He'll say anything he wants about you if you say it about him because he doesn't care. Like, there's so many different levels to not caring about shit, you know what I'm saying? But it was interesting. It was definitely interesting. I will not bow. All the angels have been commanded to bow to God's new creation, man. But Satan would not bow. Why do you not prostrate yourself, God asked. You created him of clay. You created me of fire. I will not bow to a creature. Then be gone, God cried. I will fill hell with you and all your company. Then there was war.